My name is Mohamed Alissas. I'm an economics professor at the uh, School of Business at the American University in Cairo. Regarding the question of uh, how can we accelerate growth in the Middle East and the Arab world, I think actually I have a fundamental disagreement with the premise of the question. Growth has been happening in the Arab world. Uh, the Arab world has been over the past 10 to 20 years uh, growing. Over the past 10 years, probably growing more than the world average. Uh, take a country like Egypt, it's been growing at, at a very, very uh, reasonable 6.7%. I think the problem has been how can we make the growth more inclusive? How can we make the growth actually not only help uh, the rich, wealthy, well and well connected of the elite, rather, how can we make the growth really reach out to the disenfranchised? How can it reach to the to, to women, to the youth, to the poor, uh, to the chanty towns, uh, and what have you? And uh, w when it comes to that question, I think going forward, we really have to uh, to put an emphasis uh, on, on 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 an inclusive. Uh, process whereby uh, women should become uh, part of, uh, of of the of the of the fabric of the governance fabric, both on the private and public sector, uh, where the youth are are sought out uh, in their capacity as decision makers and not only as junior analysts on both uh, on on all attributes. Uh, one way of doing that for the youth is is alleviating the obstacles in the way of entrepreneurism and uh, encourage them to achieve their own uh, dreams and, and hopes. And in order to do that, we need to provide them with some basic seed funding. Uh, it, uh, the, the, the region is afloat with, with the petrodollars, and one good use of these petrodollars would be to redirect it back to the region, specifically to help the youth, specifically to target uh, women projects, specifically at uh, small and uh, uh, small and uh, medium enterprise. So I believe it's the, the, the question should be how can we focus the growth to make it more inclusive of groups that have been left out in the past. Uh, it's not a question of how can we uh, actually accelerate the growth uh, per se.